So how do you zoom in an HTML web page uh, or any web page actually? Um, and why would you want or need to do it? Uh, one reason is because, it, especially if it's an old, maybe an older uh, website or one that's just simply not designed for a, a large resolution, for example, um, like this one, uh, the width is around um, 1100 pixels, uh, which is fine. Uh, a lot of sites, the maximum width is around um, 960 to 1300 pixels. Um, but the only problem is now with the larger resolutions with the 2550 uh, width and, and, and higher, if you have a, a website that does have a maximum width and the maximum width isn't uh, yeah, very maximal, um, it's going to look kind of awkward. It's going to be a floating box. So, so sometimes an easy way of fixing that would just to be uh, to adjust the zoom factor for each resolution. And here's how, how to do it. So here's a piece of code. Uh, just to make it easier, I uh, isolated uh, the code here um, from the rest of the HTML just to make it a little bit easier uh, uh, yeah, for you guys to, to see. So basically, we wrap it around uh, j um, JavaScript. So this is basically the uh, start of the script and this is the end of the script. And we're using uh the uh screen dot width and if so if it's greater than 1500 um uh pixels then what we do is we do a document right and then here's the actual style sheets ignore this last part that's to uh to fix something else but basically you want to document right and then uh add the zoom factor here so in this case if for the really high resolutions we have a zoom factor set for uh 150 percent now this is independent from the actual zoom inside the browser or Firefox. It's it's rendered in, in the same way, but it um, if we set 250 zoom uh, and we go into, let's say, Chrome or Firefox, uh, then at the 100%, that will be the 150 zoom that we've set. Um, and just to give you a, a demo, so right now for 1500 higher, it's at, uh, 115. I'm gonna change that to maybe 110. If I refresh it, this should be a little bit smaller. See? A little bit smaller so i'm going to go ahead and undo that and uh five percent does make a, a pretty big difference in this case not a huge difference but uh noticeable so uh that's basically how you how you would uh um uh, adjust the zoom factor and also have it so it's incremental for each resolution now in practicality uh for 1500 um between yeah, any of the under 19, 1920 and under, we can leave it around 100% zoom, but the client wanted it to fit the page a little bit better. Um, uh, and again, this is one of those designs where it's not, wasn't really designed to expand all the way. Uh, we were given the, uh, the design, uh, and we, uh, did the, uh, coding for it. Um, so hopefully you found this helpful. And if you have, uh, feel free to, uh, um, uh, yeah, feel free to share this video, uh, like this video, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, um, and uh, go to my blog, uh, yanshenghuang.com. That's uh, yanshenghuang.com. Uh, I post a lot of cool um, uh, stuff uh, about my adventures uh, on the on the main page. Uh, and if you go to, to the videos page, I actually have a ton of videos uh, explaining all sorts of things from coding to uh, Photoshop to um, WordPress to just useful pr uh, productivity tools. So ch uh, check that out. Other than that, thank you very much for uh, watching and thank you for subscribing. <music>